Hi guys! So as promised, I'll be doing a more in-depth review slash just showing you more about this bag. So this is from the Chanel's Bindi CC collection and it has the um, exotic stingray. So all along here and then on the back as well. So this purse kind of reminds me of a Chanel's surf tote just because of its shape. Um, and then this here, the straps remind me of the uh, GST. And this turn lock here kind of reminds me of the flat bag. So it's kind of like they all had a baby and then this is what came about. So this purse can be carried um, like a top handle bag or just over the shoulder. There is a pocket all the way in the front. Um, it has maroon lining in there. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. And then there's a pocket in the back as well, back here. The hardware is, um, it's not gold gold. I'm not sure if you guys can see that. I'm not sure if it's picking up in the camera. It's more of a rusted gold slash like a brassy look to it. Um, this purse is very classy slash elegant looking, yet it's very fun and edgy. Um, just because of the materials, it's so... I guess relaxed and soft. Um, so this here is the glazed calf skin. And then we have the lamb skin here, which you guys probably already know. It's just so um, delicate and it's beautiful, but it's just so hard to take care of. It scratches so easily, but it's so nice and soft and really buttery. <laughs> and then there's the, um, the stingray, which is really rough. Feels almost indestructible. So let's see inside the purse. So the interior reminds me of the GST. Looks exactly the same inside basically. You have to keep this purse super stuffed just because you don't want it to lose its shape. So this kind of helps retain it. So I'm not sure if you guys can see the maroon lining in there or it's kind of like a burgundy. There is a pocket for your cell phone here another pocket right here then there's this whole compartment section right here there's a zipper oops, compartment in the middle where you can keep your wallets and whatnot and there's another really big compartment right along here there's also another zipper compartment that's where it says um chanel made in italy this is the zipper it says chanel on there it actually still has its protective seal on there, I didn't even notice. And then there's also this little key ring, I'm not sure what it's called. And then for those of you who are interested, um, I believe the serial number is right, yep, yeah, right here. So I was told that this is one of 24 in the States. Um, I'm not sure if that's just for Neiman Marcus or for all of Chanel. So it was really hard to get my hands on it, but I'm just so glad that I did. Oh, and it has little footies on the bottom. And then there's the authenticity card. The tag for those of you who want the code. And then a little booklet, just I guess how to care for it and whatnot. And then the usual dust bag and box. So very cute, fun purse, um, beautiful. Anyways guys, thanks for watching. Um, if you can comment, like, and subscribe, have a good day.